Okay, guys, sorry about the last video ending. My friend called me and it ended my recording. Okay, now I didn't mention this boy, but his name was Joaquin. He was Daniel's crush. I sat at his table for two classes. Then Danielle would sit with him for one class whenever I sat with Kenneth. Now, I'm very sad to tell you guys this, but I had depression. I still do. It's gotten very bad now. Um, but one day in class, I looked over and I saw Kenneth and Danielle. They were LMAOing. If you don't know what that means, that means laughing my app off. Just remove the two P's and rem and replace them with S's. And then once I looked at them, I just started to feel even more sad. Like, more depressed. Like I could barely even move. Like I could barely speak. Like I was about to cry. All I could do was read a book. My vision was going blurry. And I was crying. Well, I wasn't crying, but my eyes were watering. No one talked to me, and I couldn't really hear anything besides silence and Kenneth and Danielle laughing. Like I said, I have depression. I wanted to tell you guys now, and I just wanted to say that, you know, since Kenneth and Daniel talk a lot, it makes me think that I'm not good enough and that I, I starve myself most of the time and I cry myself to sleep and I make cuts on my arms and I would show you them, but I, I really don't want to. But I just want to tell you guys that because it's true and you're my YouTube channel, I can tell you anything. I cleared up a bunch of storage on my phone, and I was able to buy a few apps, maybe about five. Some of them were Instagram, Snapchat, and Rolling Sky. I also got like 10 hours of recording out of that, so that's cool. I was on Instagram, and I was DMing um, Destiny. My friend Rhiannon was over. Her name is Black Diamond 73 I'll leave the link to her channel in the box below the description and well she's gonna be as this character because when she was still here in my room she wanted to be this character so and then she got Instagram too and I was sending her a bunch of funny pictures and then when she went home I was DMing Destiny but before I was DMing Destiny Rihanna was still over and we were on Snapchat. We were talking about a ghost, or the ghost in my house. Then I went on Snapchat, I turned on the filters, and I put on my face, and then I found something that was under my chin. It detected a face there. And then I started to freak out. I took a picture of it and I screenshotted it. It's on my Instagram story right now if you want to go check it out. And then she sent a picture to me that I took of the filter and my story. She said, that's not a ghost that happens to me all the time it just does that look I get it was a two face for a two face well I get that it was a filter for two people so it had two filters on it for two faces but that doesn't mean anything I was only in my camera Rhiannon wasn't then we got into this big battle and like this big fight and then I said I finally pulled it up and I said I will block you I didn't really she said you're gonna choose me over Rhiannon your best friend and she she said you're gonna choose Rhiannon over me your best friend and then I'm pretty sure she said pathetic and then I typed I'm not your best friend. And then I blocked her. So, there she goes out of the story. 
And then here I am, making this video. The whole Destiny thing happened about, like, what should I say, an hour ago? I don't know, but the reason why my phone, why the last video ended, I didn't end it. My friend Rhiannon called. She said she was going to come back over. She just had to go somewhere with her dad for a little while. Maybe she's coming to the mall with us. We're going to try to go to the mall today, but nothing really special. And people for who might be watching this video that are in my school, like Scarlett, Bella, or Virginia. You know what I said about that depression part? Please do not tell anyone. It's a big secret of mine. I cannot have anyone know. Okay, well, see you guys next time. Bye.